What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another exciting episode of Ripping Packs. It's so exciting that it's Friday. I know. The, the, what do we got going on? We got basketball. Some college basketball. Uh, maybe some college baseball if you could find it. Not a lot of sports uh, going on now. The football season's over, but we're getting close to baseball. Most pitchers and catchers have reported. So you know what? Let's open up some baseball. And what's it going to be today? Well, we're going to start with some Topps Chrome update. We know we opened the hanger and a couple cellos uh, the other day, and that was not too bad. But we're also going to open after that a Topps Chrome update sapphire box. I was able to pick up on Topps.com. We're going to open these two lovely products, and we're going to see what we can get. Hi there. I'm Craig Michelson, and I just got back into the hobby after more than 15 years away. Join me as I reconnect with the hobby one pack at a time. Now let's rip some packs. All right, everybody, it is Topps Chrome Update Friday day, which is not a day I've ever coined or whatever. It's just gonna be today. But anyway, Topps Chrome Update Mega Box. We have seven packs in here with four cards. It could get some good. I don't know, we should. We'll see if we were looking for the autographs and Super Fractors 101. Will we get one? I highly doubt it. But you know what? In the Sapphire box, we've got eight packs of four cards. There, it says the same thing. Look for autographs and 101 Super Fractors, the Sapphire. But we should be getting some gold, like an autograph. Um, there's green parallels, orange parallels, purple parallels, red Super Fractors. Parapata, Parpadaksha, what, whatever the hell that is. We should be getting something good in here. But you know what? Let's just rip it open. Again, we're going to do this in a second. But first things first, before I even open the regular mega box of Chrome updates, that like button, just give it a push. That subscribe button, just give it a push. And while you're at it, that notification bell, it's right there. Just go ahead, just push it. And you'll be able to watch me open up more stuff. Like Monday is going to be a big one. Uh, no, Tuesday. Monday is going to be the remainder of Bowman Heritage, but Tuesday is going to be the Tops 2021 Series 1 comparison. We got a Mega Box, we got a Blaster Box, we got a Hanger, and we got a Fat Pack. It's going to be the War and Peace of episodes. It's going to be about four hours long. So, you know, dust off that time on your calendar. Yeah, it's coming up on Tuesday. Anyway, ripping packs. Let's just get this baby open. Tops Chrome Update. You ready? Let's do this in three, two, ripping packs, go. Mm. All right, again, we've got seven packs of four cards. Did the hanger box, did the chrome packs. They're pretty good. Hoping to pull a Randy, a Razarena. Oh, there we are, four packs just neatly shoved into the bottom of this. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Seven packs of Topps Chrome Update are gonna be opened by me, yeah. All right, let's go for the top. Pack number one, Topps Chrome Update, regular, mega box. We've got ourselves, oh yeah, the kid, King Griffey Jr., home run derby, going into my PC, because I love me, uh, I grew up, he was one of my favorite players growing up. Andre Dawson was my favorite player, but he was more, you know, close to my age. Yeah, a hit. Then we have Kyle Lewis with the 2020 Decades Next to go along with my other Kyle Lewis. He's also in my PC. So we have two Seattle Mariner center fielders. One of the greatest of all time and one who's, hey, he's getting there. It's pretty close, PC pile. And then Davey Grulian for the Phillies, catch over there. I hope you uh, enjoy your time in AAA because you're going back there now that JT has signed. And the last card of the pack is Domingo Santana for the Cleveland Indians. I have no clue anything about him. Pack number one. Good. A couple Seattle Mariner greats there. Well, one great and one soon to be great. Pack number two. What you gonna do with the Chrome update? All right. Got ourselves Big Poppy, David Ortiz, with the home run derby going into the PC pile as well because I collect the Dodgers and the Red Sox. Those are the two teams I PC, American League and National League. Trust me, 2018 uh, World Series was a cluster for me. One of my teams won. Then we have Eric Davis. Oh my God, I love this guy. Eric the Red. He was such an awesome outfielder for the Reds. Not a hit, but he was awesome. I like watching this guy play. Then Jesus Lizardo going into the rookie pile with his rookie debut. Left-hand pitcher for the A's. 
And the last card of the pack is Cal Ripken with the All-Star Game card. So, cool. I mean, he's a hit, it's Cal, but I'm going for the time being into the common pile. Sorry, Cal. Pack number three. You're gonna give uh, me Aaron Judge for the Yankees with another All-Star card. Okay, it's a hit. Okay, I'm making a hit pile. Let's do a hit pile. Fine, you made me do a hit pile. Move these guys over. Then we have another grippy, a numbers game. Nice. Liking that one. Digging on that one right there. As you know, he's in the PC pile for me. Then we have Jose Altuve with the All-Star game. All right, you're going in the common pile there, buddy, into the trash can. Well, ha ha, yeah. And the last card of the pack is Tino Martinez of the Yankees, former Mariner. Actually, he got his autograph when he played for the Mariners. Yeah. All right, pack number four. You're going to give me some more of the stuff I need. Well, don't eat anything. I prefer certain things. Like Starlin Castro for the Nationals. A traded card. A true traded card because he was traded uh, from the Marlins, I believe. Oh, oh, oh. Yes! 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 And then we have Aaron Hicks autograph. Nice. That's pretty nice. Aaron Hicks autograph there. Uh, I'll take a look at the back there. I don't think it's numbered, but it looks like it's a refractor too. Um, it's not just a basic chrome, but it's an Aaron Hicks autograph. So nothing like pulling a, a Yankee. Uh, I'm not a Yankee fan at all, but you gotta respect the Yankees. That's a friggin' hit. That's awesome. That's a hit right below Aaron Judge. That's where you're gonna go. Todd Frazier, home run champion for the Cincinnati Reds. I think he's with the Mets again, I don't know. And the last card of the pack is Bo Bichette with his rookie debut. So pack number four kicks some ass. I'm not gonna lie there. Pack number four kicked ass. Sticker autograph, by the way, on the Aaron Hicks. Pack number five. You know, if I quit right now, I'd be fine. But I won't get a Lou Bob. Yeah. Pack number five. Keep me alive with a Cody Stashik rookie card for the Twins. I have no clue who that guy is, but he's gonna go in the rookie pile. Sorry, Dante. And then we have Brennan McKay, another PC hit for the decades next. A uh, uh, left-handed pitcher, first baseman. He's been getting more time on the mound because the Rays, that's kind of what they do, but he's definitely a dual threat if they give him the opportunity. So going to PC pile, we got Wilmer Flores for the Giants. Yeah. And for Remet and Randy Rosare in a rookie card. Nice. Uh, I was talking to one of my friends today in line to try and get product that I have not pulled this yet. Well, guess what? I did. That's a rookie hit. You're going to go in the rookie pile, though. Sorry, Randy, because I'm going to have to make more room for the uh, Sapphire. Pack number six. Let's go with the lovely and talented Josh Taylor for the Red Sox. Nice. Go in the PC, but I honestly can't say I know too much about the guy. Then we have Jonathan VR for the Marlins, a scrappy player over there. Then Neil Walker for the Phillies. Remember him uh, coming up? He was like a second baseman, but he was like six foot four, and now he's just a utility guy. And Anthony Rendon for the Angels, the free agent acquisition for them at third base. Who's he's pretty solid. Pack number seven of the final pack of Topps Pro Mega. Let's see. If you've graced us with anything else, like a, a Lubob, I would like a Lubob. You gave me a PC hit at least of David Price, who didn't pitch an inning for the Dodgers, but he's coming back. And man, their Dodgers are gonna be stacked in their rotation, which is good because the Padres made some moves and they're gonna be dangerous as hell. David Price, Ryan Sandberg, second baseman, great Hall of Famer for the Cubbies with the decade, with the uh, numbers game. Was a fan of him, not like, Andre Dawson still is my favorite Cub, which is weird because Sandberg was more of a Cub than him, but I grew up right at that time when Dawson became a Cub. Still a hit. And then we're gonna go to Tommy Pham for the Padres. Uh, okay, and the last card of the pack is a rookie card of Mike King for the Yankees. All right, so I honestly say we did pretty well there. Um, but Sapphire. Hmm, let's see if uh, what we can get out of this. All right, so again, I mentioned there's eight packs in here of four cards. Uh, these are 
These are pretty nice. That's all I'm gonna say. And we should get an autograph. Let's hope we get a, a name or a key rookie. That would be awesome. Ripping packs, you ready to do this? Are you ready? Because this is a very nice product. I would have loved to have gotten Bowman Sapphire uh, draft, draft Sapphire, but I kind of missed out on that. So this is the first time I'm opening Sapphire on the channel. Let's just have fun. Let's just have some fun. That's all we can do. Ripping packs. Three, two, one, let's go. All right, there we go. I'm actually kind of nervous because this wasn't, it's not gonna be a cheap rip. Okay, and they're thrown in. Here we go, one pack. Seven, eight, eight packs of cards. And if you notice, the packaging is a little different than the other one. I'll show you the packaging here for regular Chrome and then update. So we got Kyle Lewis, Mike Trout, Luis Robert, Dante Bichette, Bryce Harper, and uh, Javi ba uh, Baez. So we have the same guys, just different uniforms, different looks. Aaron Judge is the only one not on this. All right, eight packs, Sapphire, here we go. <laughs> Pack number one. Wow, these are nice. Luis Severino for the Yankees. That's a, uh, these are like those cracked ice you see from Prism and stuff, but that's a beautiful card. Yeah. Then we have Clayton Kershaw, nice, going to the PC with the active leaders. Wow, these are seriously, these are pretty badass. Then we have Jacob deGrom. He's a hit in my book just because he's such a great pitcher with the Cy Young winners, but Jacob deGrom for the Mets. He's, yeah, that's pretty nice. And then we have Alec Mills for the Cubs. So yeah, basic common uh, guy, but still a good looking card. So, all right, pack number one, we got a PC hit, Clayton. Pack number two, You're gonna grace us with some goodness of the Sapphire's finest. Well, we've got ourselves Thomas Nito for the uh, Mets, the New York Mets. Kind of lingering on these a little longer just because of how, the, how nice they are. Then we have Justin Verlander. I'm gonna throw him in the hit pile just because he's Justin Verlander. And he's gonna be in the Hall of Fame one day. Yeah. Justin Verlander. Then we have Tyler White, who I think didn't, he actually never saw an at-bat for the Dodgers. He ended up didn't make it in the squad and he ended up playing, I think, over in the Korean League uh, this last year. PC hit, because he's wearing the Dodgers. Yeah, that's kind of how I have to roll. And, oh, we got five cards in here. Then Joe Kelly for the Dodgers. That is PC hit, because he actually is still playing for them. So that's a nice one. And then the last card of the pack is Mike Moustakis for the Reds. So we got, we got Grace with a bonus card. That's very sweet of you, Tops, very sweet. All right, pack number three. All right, we got ourselves Polar Bear and Squirrel. Yeah, that's uh, obviously uh, Pete Alonzo, and I wanna say Jeff McNeil, but I could be wrong. That's going in the basic card pile. Then we have Jordy Mercer for the Tigers. Nice little card there. Again, I'm, I'm just going to stop commenta commenta uh, commentating how nice of a card it is because we're obviously, they are nice. Then we have PC hit at least, time to party with Alexander Bogarts and Raphael Devers celebrating walk-off. And uh, one thing to know is they're both still on the team. Yeah, they just traded band attendee and yeah, it's, it's going to be a different team, but you know, it's okay. And the last card is Tyler Heineman for the Giants. I've joked about this. It's nice to make him be a major leaguer, but nothing like a 30-year-old major league rookie. It's awesome for them, but when you're pulling it out of this, you don't want this guy. Just saying. But Tyler Heineman for the win. All right, pack number three, four. Pack number four. Ooh, it's getting brutal right now. Pack number four. You're gonna give me a battery bath for the Dodgers. Russell Martin, who's no longer on the team, but that's going into my PC pile because he's a Dodger. Then we, oh, we got something, got some color coming up here real quick. And then we have Drew Brutera for the Rockies. Uh, cool. Pull the back card out before we get to the other one. Pujols, the machine with the All-Star Game card. That's a hit because he's going to be in the Hall of Fame, so you might as well throw him in there. Am I right? Yeah, that's what you do. And the last card of the pack is... It's gold, it's that semi-circle. It's a, uh, is that Griffey? 
Yes, Griffey with the home run derby card with a gold number. Oh my God. One of one. <laughs> a super fractor, one of one. Oh my God, and it's a guy I PC. That is so friggin' sweet. Holy crap. Oh, wow. Um, that is huge. Wow, yesterday I pulled the Lou Bob auto. This. Okay, I joke about it, but man, these are hands of fire right now. Oh my God. <laughs> A one of one on a guy I PC on a Hall of Famer. Not a rookie. I like, you know, there's only a handful of rookies on here, but that's awesome. That is friggin' awesome. Oh, this pack feels thick. Okay. I'm going to a different pack because I think that thick pack might be something. But either way, it might be have 10 cards. I don't know. Here we go. Pack number five. Whoa. Damn, that Griffey's awesome. We got Zach Granke for the Astros. I've been putting him in my hip pile because he's going to be a Hall of Famer. So I'll just pull him now and get it out of the way. And we got another hit coming up here at least. Julie's Chassine for the Minnesota Twins. And we'll pull this card up right now. We got Tyler Frazier again. Oh, well, okay, whatever. If there's any Tyler Frazier fans out there, I've got a card for you. And the last card of the pack is, uh, let's see if I go back this way. It's, uh, it's a hitter, two years. Play to 19, play Arizona Cubs and Tennessee. Is it, is it, uh, oh God, the outfielder for them. Um, Nico Horner autograph. Nice. Not numbered, but that Griffey is pretty badass. I, I think I'm good on the numbered. But yeah, Nico Horner autograph there. It's, you're asking for a rookie card for one of these, not some, you know, some low end, uh, low end vet. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, it's a, a sticker. Oh, is it on? No, it's a sticker autograph. But still, that's pretty awesome. That's a pretty awesome hit to pull um, a rookie, a legit rookie. And the Cubs are definitely in a rebuilding phase right now. That's, whew. <laughs> still got three more packs here. Sapphire is so far living up to its name. Pack number six. Okay, sorry, pack, you ruined yourself. We've got Chase Anderson for the Blue Jays. Uh, don't know much about him. Then we have Bryce Wilson for the Atlanta Braves. Again, don't know too much about him. Pull, we got a, oh, just a basic card here. We have all-star rivals. We have Mookie and Glaber, all-star game. So technically it's not a PC hit, but I'm throwing on there because it's got Mookie, because he's now a Dodger and I collect, yeah. Yeah, that, yeah. So that's cool. And then the last card of the pack here is Tino Martinez again with the home run derby card for the All-Star Game. And you already heard my spiel on Mr. Martinez. Pack number seven. Ooh. All right, we've got Jose Martinez for the Rays. Okay. Then we've got Kiri Mela, Mila, Melia of the Diamondbacks. Don't know much about him, um, but obviously I can't even say his name. So that might be a reason why. We have Josh Fuentes for the Rockies. Again, same thing, don't know too much about him. And the last card of the pack is Logan Morrison for the Brewers. All right, last pack, pack number eight. Four cards, but it's thick, so maybe there's something else in here, I don't know. You ready? This has been a fun rip, to be honest with you. Yeah. Let's just go, pack number eight, ripping packs. Mm. Good God, okay, there's a bunch of extra cards in here. But hey, Mike Trout, you cannot go wrong with a Mike Trout. Sapphire, Mike Trout, that's definitely going into the hit pile. That's awesome. And then we have, there's the hit pile right there. Derek Holland for the Pirates. He's, a, he's just one of those guys you like watching pitch. He's kind of, he's he's a cool dude, but as a pitcher, he's, he's okay. Then we have Pedro Stroop for the Reds. And then we have Ty France for the San Diego Padres. Um, don't know much about him, sorry. I know you come to me for all this information. I can't tell you anything about Ty France. I just don't know anything. We have Kyle Ryan for the Cubs. Two cards left, which is crazy we have this money. 
Then we have Grayson Griner for the Tigers. Catcher over there. And the last card of the pack is Aaron Judge. Nice. Of the uh, home run variety, my Major League Baseball All-Star game. So I pulled chrome variations on both of him. So, yeah. Um, wow. Um, I will say, obviously, Sapphire was a bit pricey. But, I mean, I'm just going to start. Pull with the chrome. Pull the chrome Randy Orozarena. That's a nice little hit there. But then getting the Aaron Hicks autograph to match with it. That's that right there. That's quality enough in the mega box. That's pretty awesome. But then pulling the one of one Griffey and the Nico Horner um, for the Sapphire, along with a couple other hits. I mean, honestly, the Sapphire box, the Griffey completely made that box worth it. But the Horner autograph is nice. I didn't pull any other real rookies, which is kind of a bummer on that, but you know, it is what it is. Did pull a Trout though, so obviously he pulled one of the greatest players in the game right now. That's pretty awesome. So I'd say Sapphire was definitely a hit. Would have liked a couple more rookie cards there, but hey, it is what it is. I got some PC hits on both. Um, yeah, it's not a comparison edition, it's just a Topps Chrome Update day. And a Sapphire day, yeah. Anyway, thank you so much for watching Ripping Packs. Um, Make sure to uh, gently touch that subscribe button. And if you gently touched it, maybe you know whisper into its ear, hey, I'd like to press your like button. You, it'll let you. That notification bell, just push it without even asking. They won't care. Yeah. Thank you again for watching Ripping Packs. Have a great weekend and I will see you on Monday. Take care.